I'm back. I feel like it's been forever. What it is, what it do, and what it be like. It's your girl Michi, and I'm back with another video. And if you are new here, hi, my name is Michi, and I do business and fashion related content. And if you are a returning subscriber, what it is, what it do, and letting them other people know how we be. So, as you can tell from the title of this video, I am doing a huge green clothing haul. Every item I own that has green in it, that's what I'm showing y'all today. Now, I was going to try the stuff on, but I have plenty, plenty plenty of videos where y'all can skim through and see me trying all this stuff on but i'm not because quite frankly i just don't feel like it but before we get into all of that if you like any of my last videos or you like this video which i know you will go ahead and subscribe subscribe down below like this video comment what you want to see next and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified the next time that i upload now let's get into it first we're gonna start with the things you don't really wear i mean you wear them but you don't i don't have to do another clip just so y'all can see it so we're gonna start with the accessories the first thing i have are these like they're like thin clearish green glasses you wear them down like that i really only wore these like once or twice i bought them for um my birthday last year sadly i didn't record it but i will record my birthday coming up it's july 2nd so y'all stay tuned for that I might do a little birthday vlog get ready with me all of that i think i got those off amazon i don't ask me for a link to that because i don't know next we got these they're just they're like cubed ish shaped glasses but they kind of remind me of like cloud goggles but they're green and have like this like foggy clear shade so they're not all the way clear but these are them they go all the way over your eyes i actually really like these a lot i got these from charlotte russe they were ten dollars but they were having a half off sale so i got it for five so the next thing i wanted to show y'all is this purse i got this from a Shein haul which will be linked in one of these corners y'all will be able to see it in there it's just a small little purse with this little knot i thought it was cute to be honest when i got this i thought the purse was going to be bigger but it is what it is it's still cute and everything i just wish it was bigger it has the magnetic clip to clip it and it comes with this gold chain as y'all can see also the chains are i don't know if you can see this but you can take the chains on and off basically i can unhook this and you can just wear a regular but what i do is if i don't want to take the chain off i'll just tuck it inside of the purse like this See, and then like when you close it, it don't, you can't even see it anywhere. So what's the point of taking it off? This can't even fit my phone. So this is literally for like just some change, your wallet, and that's it. The next purse is this. It's kind of like a um aqua. It's like, I don't know what you call this. I'm gonna just say aqua, but yeah, it's like a super mint. That's the color I was looking for, mint. I got this from Amazon too for like $15. I don't have the link for it, but this is the name of the brand is Aluda Piju. I'm gonna put it up on the screen, but that's what it looks like. And it has a B on the front of it, but it looks like a mini backpack kind of like. It has the handle here. So these can get taken off too. Like these long straps can get taken off, but you can wear it like this, or you can wear it like, you know, this, and then it goes longer or shorter, however you want to wear it. It comes with three pockets. You have the pocket in the front, which is like, you know, a thin pocket. This could probably hold like your phone, the immediate stuff you need. The second pocket is a deeper pocket that goes all the way to the back for the most part for like, you know, money, bigger stuff that you need to carry. And then it also has a back thin pocket for the same thing. Uh, I'm not sure what this little hole in the back is for. But I think this is great quality for the money I paid for it. And as you can see, it's still in super good condition. But yeah, I wore that for my birthday too. The next purse is this purse right here. It's this dark green like croc material purse. This is called a, a baguette bag, I think, but it has the strap that goes with it. Also, there's buttons so you can adjust the short strap. I said, okay, cause I didn't even know you could do that. But yeah, it has the silver zipper and there aren't any pockets in this. It's just a one big pocket. Most baguette bags are like that. I got this one from Shein, which is in another Shein haul that I did. So I'll have that linked in the corner as well. I really like this bag too, because it has some texture. The other ones don't really have as much texture with it, but yeah, this is super cute. 
to be honest i think that's all the accessories i don't think i have any more like accessories so next we'll just go to well we'll go to the one pair of shoes that i have which are these i know y'all remember when everybody was wearing these the sad part is i've never even worn these out the house but they are super comfortable and you see they like that mint color as well these are actually super cute i got these online from like a random i just searched it up and then these popped up so i bought them and i think for like 30 dollars or something but yeah these are super cute they're like the double striped sandals i think these are like what is it called they're like mock-ups of the birkin i think it was birkin somebody has sandal a big brand has sandals like this and they're super cute but i actually like them because of the dip it basically molds to your foot like as y'all can see the little you know so yeah, I really like these a lot. I just need to f figure out what to do with them as far as outfit wise so that I can actually wear them. So the next thing is pants. We're just gonna go to pants. The other reason I'm not trying this stuff on is because most of y'all have seen these pants multiple times, but we're just gonna do it anyways for the sake of the green video. The first thing, first pants are the ones I'm wearing right now. Yeah, they're just like some straight leg pants, nothing super extra. It literally is just straight leg pants. They're regular. I thrifted them, that's pretty much it. They're olive green colored, they were cute, so I copped them. Luckily, they fit perfectly, like. The second pair of pants are these pants. You've probably already seen these before if you watch any of my last videos. If you haven't, go ahead and go watch that. Anyways, these are some, they're basically just like, I guess you would call them scrubs. I don't know what they're called, but these are just like some light green pants. They're big and baggy and they are Dickies brand. Um, luckily they have a drawstring because the waist is a little big on me. These were thrifted. So that's the reason they aren't my right size, but I like that it's big enough because it makes the legs bigger and it just fits the way I want it to fit. So there's those. The next one are these camo pants or forest pants, whatever you want to call them. Um, these are big as well. That's why I paired it with this belt. They have the camo print, and you know, everybody on the camo print trend and I'm on it too. It's cute. I like it. It still fits great. Like no complaints either. Those were thrifted by the way. Normally most of the stuff I thrift, I thrift in the men's section because their pants are bigger, baggier, and they just fit the way I want to. Most of the women's section stuff is super tight fitting. And I'm just, that's not what I'm on. The next pair of pants, these are green too. They have brown and black in them, but I just put them in here because they're green. These are some army pants, army slash camo pants. And the good thing about the military pants is that they have, first off, they have these adjustable straps. I actually, tightened them and made them stay where I needed them to so it always fits my waist and then on the bottom they have the drawstrings for the pants on the ankles if you wanted it that way it's up to you they have the cargo pants pockets on the side so when you wear them it just adds a lot more texture to the outfit and I just love it we love it the next pair of pants I mean not pants these are shorts these are sweat shorts that I got from Walmart actually they were sweatpants but I got bleach on the bottom of the leg or something like that. So I just cut it and hand sewed the bottom, hemmed it up and made them shorts. Yeah, don't forget your girl make clothes, okay? Next, we just gonna move into tops. The first thing is this. It's just a, like that olive green. A lot of my stuff is olive green, but I'm trying to find other colors, but this olive green color, I just always gravitate towards this. Anyways, it's just a tank top nothing extra it's just a rib tank top that i got from walmart and these are actually super cute i got this in about five six other different colors because they're just so cute and they were only like three dollars per tank top so i was like <laughs> give me this that 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 if you've seen in my most recent thrift haul also i'm keeping the hangers on here because i don't feel like taking them off but in my most recent thrift haul, I thrifted this. It says, what happens in the van stays in the van. I just thought it was cute, you know what I'm saying? The mystery van with Scooby-Doo and Shaggy. It looks old and vintage, but that's just the way it's printed on. I just really like this, plus it's green. And y'all already know, green is my favorite color. So this next shirt is a 116 shirt, which was also thrifted a while ago. If y'all don't know the group 116, look it up i just like the graphic on the front and then i like the little like the way the six is on the back but super cute like it and it's green it goes with a lot of stuff next we have my own design which is the 
all a dream tea on my website so if you haven't checked out my website go to timmyclothing.com it'll be linked in the description below and i might also have it up on the screen for y'all but yeah this is a shirt that i sell it also comes in red black white and gray so i think it comes in blue too if i'm right but yeah it's bart simpson made to look like biggie counting the money and everything and it says it was all a dream so this next thing was a little diy project right this was a t-shirt and i cut it to a tube top basically and in this you just tie in the back they're like the strings that you tie in the back so you just wrap it around you know what i'm saying i'm not gonna try it on right now because i don't feel like it but you get the point it just looks like a regular green tube top when you try it on actually i think i have a picture of it so i'm gonna put it right here on the screen that's what it looks like on when you try it on so i mean i guess this counts as a shirt it's a button down long sleeve shirt that i got thrifted it's by the brand infinity i think yeah infinity it's an extra large i got it out the men's section but when i thrifted this it was a dollar so i just got it just because like a dollar i'm gonna find something to do with it i might just use it mainly for like pull over like what you wear over stuff you know how people do long sleeves and stuff like that so there's that it's cute the next is a jacket that i got from walmart again out of the men's section y'all y'all don't don't sleep on the men's section they be having all the good quality stuff this i got from the men's section it's just a regular jacket most of y'all probably seen this before seen stuff like that um it's i got it in the medium i just like the inside because when you get like new stuff the fur and the inside or the fleece or whatever this is be super soft and yeah i just love the way it fits it's oversized and all of that so next we have this which was also thrifty y'all my whole closet is thrifty at this point but this was it's basically they call it a coach jacket like what coaches wear on the field or period i guess but it's like this windbreaker material and then in the inside it has the fleece which i thought was different because most of the time when i see windbreaker stuff they don't have like soft like this is an actual coat it's not just like a jacket you know what i'm saying and um i really like it it just gives me like vintage vibes you know i think it's in a it's in a size large I thrifted it. It was brand new with tags, so I said, why not? I can't remember how much it cost. And it's a different color green, too. Like, it's like that darker green. It's not olive green. The next thing is, this is black, but I wanted to include it because it has my logo for my business on it, and the logo got some green in, you know what I'm saying? So, y'all have seen me wear this hoodie multiple times. Timmy merch, you can go shop. It'll be down in the link in the description below. I'm just, that's all I'm gonna say. And last but not least, the one that everybody been hype about, this. This is a jean jacket that I made. I custom made it. Um, I actually have a video on me custom making it. So you guys can go check that out. I'm not going to go into too detail with that. That's all I'm going to show you of it. If you want to see more, you got to go check out the video. With that being said, that's everything. Like, that's all the stuff that I have that's green. Most of the stuff y'all seen already. Some of the stuff y'all haven't. But y'all seen it all here. Now I'm going to get more green stuff and I might do another green haul soon because I just love the color green and green looks good on me. That is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and subscribe, subscribe down below. Like this video, comment what you want to see next and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified the next time that I upload. And I will see y'all again in the next one.